All right, let us expo explore <laughs> four side. Let us. Let us. We need to go into the top of the theater. Mm -hmm. oh, do I have any money on me? Yes, I do. <laughs> do you want to buy a ticket? Yes, 30 bucks. Thanks a lot. You are welcome. Please have your ticket. Oh, forget you always have to like actually do it. Use items. Thanks a lot. Please hurry. The show will be starting at any moment. Now. Let's go into this door first. Uh huh. Let's bust up in the manager's office. Oh yeah. Talk to this whore. Huh. So you have one way five fan, huh? What? Excuse me? No, no. This band owes me a million bucks. If they break the contract, they'll be in deep duty with police. The police would probably say, hey, you guys, or something like that. Unless you're able to pay a million dollars on their behalf, you have to find buried gold, or you would never be able to pay such a huge sum of money. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, ho, ho. She's apparently a Santa Claus. Buried <laughs> gold? Didn't we hear about that somewhere before previously? <laughs> Perhaps? I'm not sure. These weird people in the seats. It's a yeah. bigger theater than the chaos theater. When this arrives, the Runaway Five told me to let him in. So please come in. Waddle, 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 waddle. Let's talk to these idiots. Oh, We're wow. so helpless. Really helpless and hopeless. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Yeah, you are. Again, we've been cheated by the theater owner. We're stuck here with a phony contract. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. We know how to sing, but we don't know how to handle money or women. Do wap, do do wap. It's because you talk like that. <laughs> to meet. Geldegard. Geld. Good lord. Geldegard. Monotoly, you'll need our help. I don't exactly know why. It's just a hunch. We owe you guys so much. Sorry. You better be. Galdegard, that's a hell of a name. <laughs> and now we get to see another Runaway 5 show. Have I got a bombshell for you tonight, kids? Ah! <laughs> no, really, it's a bomb! Run! Kaboom! The Runaway 5, yeah! 3, 2, 1, go! That was Runaway 5 show. Uh, do not go back in there. I hate you so much. Oh, good God, seriously. I am not. Oh. Jesus. You, you have a, a. I know, I'm just getting past the text. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Well. Get the hell out of here. Shall we? Yes, we shall. Oh, hi. One moment. Alright. <clears throat> Sorry about that. We're back. Whoop. That's a little out, I think. Tiny bit. So yeah, we saw the Runaway 5 show. Woo! Go us. Let's go to the Dinosaur Museum. Let's. Where there are dinosaurs. Live ones. Dino. I, I like love I like this music. Mm -hmm. Hey you, over there. Get over here. No. The admission fee is five dollars per person. Is that okay with you? Yes, with my eleven thousand dollars. Please go in. You'll find an expert in the area of arts and sciences. But none on dinosaurs. No. All 
I really do like this music. Mm -hmm. It's a very large skeleton. Dinosaur blones? Blones. Blones. Bones believed to be from southern Scar Scaraba. Scaraba. Don't ask for any details. Our research is continuing. We don't know shit about these bones. Alright, that's enough of you, buddy. This museum should sell dinosaur t-shirts. I guess so. Huge! Not you, I'm talking about the dinosaur bones. Huge, not you. Oh, is that the little girl? I don't know. Who yeah, is. that is a little girl. She has a very deep voice. She does. I wonder how many animals go extinct before human beings discover them. I want to see a live dinosaur sometime in my life. You're going to die disappointed and alone. I think that was a guy, too. I don't care. Like, whatever. Oh, it's this creepy guy. I'm so happy there are some visitors today. These days, few people come here. I'm Mr. Spoon, the academic researcher. I wonder if there are any famous stars here today. Dinosaurs. Huge, aren't they? Well, that's all I've gotten out of my research. You want to hear more? To tell you the truth, I heard that dinosaurs were found near the lower side of Scaraba. And that there were lots of them. There are unconfirmed reports that the dinosaurs ate some of the natives there. If you go, please try to find the dinosaurs sores and bring back photographs. Please come back again to study, because I don't like being alone. <laughs> He's weird. He is weird. I don't think I like him. No. This is a crappy museum. <laughs> that museum was a huge disappointment. Wasn't it just? Yeah, it was. And the department store is closed. Let's go in this building. Monotoly. Building. Last night there was a solitaire tournament. I lost my shirt. I'll invite you next time. Hey, wait. Do you even know what solitaire is? I think he originally says Monopoly in the Japanese version. I'm an elite businessman who works in Mr. Monopoly's office. <laughs> Hello, baby face. What brings you to the Monopoly <laughs> building? Can't ever say it right. You know stuff. I always want to say Monopoly, but I know yeah, it's... Me too. This elevator is for Master Pokey's use. It goes directly to the 47th floor. Quit staring at my hips. Why don't you stand somewhere else instead of behind me? But I'm in front of you. It's for Master Pokey's use only, yet we just went right up. I guess. Hey, look. Black dudes. Are you a friend of Master Pokey? It's okay to visit him here, but don't wander around the building. Someone might be suspicious of you and take a pot shot at you with a machine gun. Ten-year-old kids, really? Whoops. I was almost going to beat you up. Really? Just randomly there? <laughs> wow, it's Pokey. Ooh la la. This, this, my poor old friend. Ah. Uh, What's your name? Pig's butt. No, no, Ness. Didn't you come here to beg me for some money? Ooh la la. Don't you recognize me? I'm Master Pokey. Pokey! Get it? It's not a joke, dude. I'm now... You say that. I'm <laughs> Geldegard. Geldegard, Monopoly's partner. <laughs> and I give him political and economic advice because as an 11-year-old, I know about these things. <laughs> I heard there were some ratty-looking kids asking for Mr. Monopoly. Was that you, Ness? This isn't a place for the likes of you. Get out of here. Now, loser. And then we get escorted out. Or wiggled against. <laughs> yeah. You must never show your face around Master Pokey. You got that? You gonna punch me, too? Rough up my kidneys, make me pee blood? That kind of thing? Yeah. Who are you? Oh, you're Pokey's dad, I guess. You haven't changed much, Ness. I'm... Aloysius? Aloysius Minch. Pokey's dad. What kind of fucking name is that? Due to my son's success, I now live the life of a rich man. Every dog has its day. That's the perfect proverb to describe me. Ha! Ha ha! Ha ha ha! Ho 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 ho! Gwah! Ha 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 Ooh, my 
jaw is tired. I'm sucking dick. I don't wow. know why I was just angry at him right there. <laughs> Laughing like that was fun. You look like you were having fun. Viewers, I wish you could have seen him. It was it was pretty awesome. Private elevator. No operation. Not for operation by the general department. No, 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 no. Things. <sighs> yeah, yeah, don't stare at your hips, woman. You ain't got a figure. Don't even worry about it. <laughs> Let me off this crappy elevator. Let's see. Let me check the map. Okay. What have you got to say, cop? You boys are sneaking around looking for Mr. Manali, aren't you? If I catch you boys doing anything, I'll arrest you. No questions asked. Be prepared. Got it, Ness? Ha ha ha! I've already checked out your name. That's creepy. I'm glad you have. I was hoping you did, actually. We don't need to go to the hospital. Can you read these signs? There's there's lots of junk like this bulletin board at the junk shop. Bust it up. Located in the back alley of the department store. Back alley of the department store. Okay. I don't care. <laughs> what about this sign? Planning meeting for Earthbound 2. One of those who are related to the project. A software developer. <laughs> Uh, there was eventually one. It just took him like ten fucking years. Yeah. That car is angry at us. That car is an enemy. You engaged yes. the mad taxi. Yes, it is. The mad taxi. That just happened. It did just happen, because... You know, did just happen? It did just happen. I make all of my words <laughs> past tense when I talk. You can't judge me. I'm judging you harshly. It's a hotel. Have we stayed in the hotel yet? No. Not Lee Grand Odell. $75 a night. Well, let's stay in the hotel for the fuck of it. This better be awesome. Ness, sir! Are you staying here tonight? Thanks for being so generous with your tips. You never gave me a tip? Never mind. Dick back. 225 Yeah, I'll stay. Whatever. Chump change to me. Hey, fix a broken laser. Laser gun! Sweet. Jeff now has a laser gun. Yeah. I have to equip it though, because I'm smart. Mm -hmm. Zip gun. 70 78, I'll take it. Zip gun is actually just a. Uh, a very cut down shotgun. Stock cut off in the barrel, it's mostly removed. Good morning! This is a unique skirt. Service exclusive to our hotel only. <laughs> I'm here to read you today's headline. On the front page of the Foresight Post, over 70% of Foresight citizens support Monopoly. Yeah, I, I, my brain stopped reading. Hey you! If you meet a beautiful, seductive woman who's looking for me, tell her hi. Anyway, I don't think a woman like that would be looking for me. Then why'd you ask me to do things for you, dude? <laughs> That's silly. Especially with that creepy grin on your yeah. face. You look weird, dude. Mm. What, what about you? The city of Forsyth has developed quite a bit since Mr. Geldegard Monodly hit the big time. It's been good for the city. Okay, that's the way. We don't want to go out of the city. We are actually trying to get to a place. Sort of. Up this way, maybe? Hey, there's a woman. I've heard some bad rumors about Mr. Monodoli. I heard he made a deal with a pure evil entity in exchange for power. You know, stuff like that. Well, who hasn't made a deal with evil entities for power? I know I have. Ooh, the cave! Let's go inside. <laughs> Weird music in the cave. Weird looking people in the cave. Seems like it's just for decoration. I was in the middle of a caffeine buzz, alcohol, and I had to get to the bathroom fast. When I got there, I accidentally knocked on the wall instead of the restroom door. The next thing I knew, someone asked, who is it? And it really surprised me. Maybe I just imagined it? I'm surprised you talked to an ordinary guy like me. I have no information or items to help you out. 
Don't you think it's natural for a guy like me to be here? I enjoy the atmosphere here. By the way, let me quiz you. There are five apples. Eat one. How many are left? Five minus one is four. So four is left. Ah, it's not funny. Okay, here's another one. I don't get that joke. Maybe I'm just stupid. <laughs> Master Pokey's maid Electra is made to order. Oh, buns aren't funny either. No, they are not. People watching. I used to be Monopoly's employee. <laughs> I realized this scheme has made my company go bankrupt. My house and land are taken away. Now I'm homeless. Monopoly didn't used to be so powerful. I'm gonna find out his secret, so I'm spending my time here and watching to see if he ever drops in. Fuck that. Went bad quick. Kids shouldn't be drinking es espresso. Alcohol. Alcohol. You shouldn't be hanging around here. What? Mr. Monopoly's here. You got that wrong, kid. What? She's so creepy. Does Mr. Geldegar and Monopoly come here often? Hello, time to get up. Could never happen. Well, actually, that's not true. Paused in the wrong place. I'm not talking to you, whore. She's a whore. Is I don't she? care what anybody says. Okay. Fat whore. Lipstick smeared around her face like that. She's a crack whore. <laughs> or has bad aim. I don't know which one. See if we can go into the depth store now. Forget it. what exactly you have to do. We either have to go and see there's a depth store. Yes, creepy noises. I was not trying to catch that butterfly. I was just trying to move quickly. Or that butterfly. I'm just I love speeding things up. I'm trying to get back to the desert. The dessert. Somebody's got sunstroke already, seriously. Look, it's bigger now. I have lots of work to do, but I can't seem to move. I'm so curious about the dig. I can't help it. It's like drugs. Out walking in the desert must make you very hungry and thirsty. What do you want? Uh, none of that shit. Oh, wow, we all have sunstroke. So you don't want to buy anything? So you may not be okay. No, I don't need any help. I think you should dig somewhere else. What do you know? If we have a live broadcast from the dig, I can check out the dig while relaxing on the floor. Okay. I've been watching them dig for a while. I wonder what they'll find. Sunstroke. I'll find a sunstroke. That flashing is annoying. Yeah. Oh, it did not cure my sunstroke. That sucks. I'll get around to it. I'll just die of heat exhaustion. Whichever comes first. We got sunstruck quick. Yeah, we did. Okay, yeah, that's... Got I'm, I'm doing stuff right now, so you just... You just go on with that. Okay, we can use alpha. I didn't want to use beta thinking that I had to use it and then waste a bunch of PP. And that's it. Sunstroke was cured. If you have sunstroke, I don't think you're walking around though. That's... Yeah. I didn't have a problem digging until this. I found a maze. Lots of monsters appeared, so I couldn't proceed. There's five big moles. If I beat the monsters, I can continue on. I think I have a bleeding ulcer from worrying too much. I'm helpless to really do anything. Ah, uh, you kids do something. Fuck it. Wander around in this maze with these giant moles. Thirsty coil snake. It's pink because it's thirsty. Sure. That logic makes sense. It kind of does. Not really, though. No. Shut up. Makes sense. Enemies here, a little tough. Especially those fucking snakes. I don't like them. I think I remember disliking the snakes. Yeah. They get annoying after a while. Yes. Especially since I don't know where I'm going. And there are five bosses to fight. Yeah. Paula, you could not be any more useless right now if you tried. Beat the shit out of everything. Ah, oh, damn it, you whore. Paula got poisoned. Ah, oh, she. That was the worst level up ever, Paula. Yeah. Really? One? 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 
think it's beta they have to know. Ah, oh, fuck it, let's go down. Let's pr proceed cautiously. Let's learn to friggin' talk. That would be a boss. We are going to save. We are. That would be the smart thing to do. Probably. I'm one of the masters of this hole. There are five masters in all. We are all moles, of course. I believe I'm the third strongest among us. Take your best shot. 